was supposed to be a super quick project it turned into a few hours of pure indulgence <laughs> and I'm okay with that I really don't mind this was supposed to be I don't know I had no idea really I thought I was gonna make florals because that's kind of like my go-to and then when I was stuck with the mess I started having visions of pink forests <laughs> and I thought why not let's go for it and so that's how it turned into a pink forest. I just spent a few minutes removing those white dots because there's we're not gonna have snow in my pink forest and it's not a fall forest it's pink it's a pink forest it's a pink forest I don't want to think about fall I don't want to think about snow so that's why I went over the dots that were left over when I removed the masking fluid that I had splashed previously yeah I went over them with a, a wash of an acridone coral and I am resisting the urge of shading with color pencils I even took them out because I thought I was going to do it but I've already spent a lot of time on it and I kind of want to learn how to shade with just watercolor paint and so that's what I'm going to be working on it's not easy I find it's very difficult and it's okay to use color pencils, you know, there's nothing wrong with that, but I don't want to have to rely on them. I kind of want to be able to do it all. I kind of want to be able to shade with the paints or shade with the pencils. And I know how to shade with pencils. I've done it a few years, for a few years, but shading with the watercolor paints can sometimes be tricky, especially when you have um, dimension to your painting like I have trees that are further away and you know I was trying to play with that as well at the same time so anyways I'm happy with the final result I hope that you will enjoy the bits and pieces that I filmed because I could not film everything it's impossible if you feel inspired by this let me know how your pink forest would look like and if you find a pink forest alert me I want to go there okay Thanks so much for watching. <laughs> As usual, I will put the list of supplies in the description below. You just have to click on show more underneath the YouTube uh, window. Thank you, my awesome patrons, for supporting my art over at Patreon. It is greatly appreciated.
If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. Thank you so much for watching. Have a super fun and creative day and I will see you tomorrow.